Hello, magical butterfly. Welcome to the Venus in Virgo love messages from the universe. Venus, the planet of love, went into the sign of Virgo on October 8th, 2023. 10 8 23 equals angel number 23. Angel number 23 brings you the affirmation, I am adventurous. You have a zest for life and you are eager to experience anything and everything possible. You love change and excitement and need both to feel truly alive for your life, for you, is an adventure to be lived to the fullest. So you're learning how to be adventurous. So I feel there has been a change that has occurred for you since Venus went in Virgo, because remember, this is timeless. Angel number five symbolizes the word change. And it tells you by being open to change, being accepting to change, you are adaptable. Flexibility is your forte. When life throws you a curveball, you can easily adapt to new circumstances and find excitement in the unexpected change. Be brave and bold in your endeavors. So when you are adventurous, when you are adaptable, you become the change seeker. You become the change that you seek. So let's see what messages spirit has for you when it comes to change and just what this energy has brought you. It has brought you the goddess of truth. So you have been given the truth when it comes to divine love, your divine love connection with your divine love counterpart. You have finally admitted the truth to yourself. Whatever that truth is, you have finally acknowledged it. And what you have acknowledged is the lovers. You have acknowledged the commitment that you want to have with your divine love counterpart. The love that you have for your divine love counterpart. Maybe you have always denied if this person was the one but you no longer can deny it. Instead, you are shifting from the lady of secrets with struggle and manipulation to the goddess of truth. You don't want to struggle anymore. You don't want to manipulate yourself from believing in this divine love because feeling this way feels good because it aligns with your true feelings. So being able to shed the Lady of Secrets helps you understand with Father Healing that you have healed yourself. You have healed yourself enough to understand that things are what they're supposed to be. Because the Sun is showing me that you have the spiritual powers you have the light within you that is going to shine the way going forward. So by admitting your true feelings that you have for your divine love counterpart to yourself out loud has been a game changer. It has brought you into the energy of the high priestess where you are now able to really listen to your intuition. And by listening to your intuition, you are able to connect to the angels of love to be able to ask, to ask spirit for what you seek. And what you seek is direction and reflection. Spirit wants you to know that you see yourself. You see yourself. You see what's in your heart. And when I said that, my timer was at 444. You see that the unconditional love that you've had for yourself is now transmuting and transitioning into the love you have for this person. 
you are understanding the divine love connection that you have with your person is much deeper than you originally thought because your heart has been charged for some of you venus in virgo helped the heart chakra open perhaps your heart chakra was closed to love to this person so you are now divine feminine the queen of fire you have that courage and spark to really go within your heart and she's pregnant on this card so you're about to birth something because you're seeing your connection with a new perspective you have love you have compassion for your divine masculine but also for yourself and your perspective is really making you understand what do you see not with your physical eyes but with your third eye you are letting your instincts and your third eye lead the way this is a huge karmic cycle closure that you have experienced and you are now going to start moving forward you are going to trailblaze and move forward you are releasing any toxic ties to the past those feelings behaviors people situations just don't vibe with you anymore and you're just not having it anymore because you have found balance with the god of balance you have mastered your emotions and now you no longer will allow your your mind to trick you because you are now with your intuition because lesson has been completed you have found self-love you have found self-worth. This tower moment that Venus in Virgo most likely brought you has brought you everything that you needed. It's almost like the pieces, the, the one thing that you thought was missing is finally here. And that has brought in the death card, the transmutation, the transformation. And now your divine masculine wants you to know that no matter what is going on in his life, you are always on his mind he is protected you are protected by the goddess of love this is a beautiful connection that is blessed by spirit so your heart chakra being opened is definitely making you feel very weird is really what i'm hearing you're very unfamiliar but the sadness of the heartbreak is coming to an end that is confirmed by the end just let it go and make a wish and allow the universe to align what is meant to be with this love connection in divine timing so simply start moving forward by going with gut reactions and making decisive actions that are intuitive that lead you to your new beginning and know that you are the goddess of power you are the divine feminine. You are the divine masculine. You can manifest your dreams by taking the divine wisdom that you have and move it forward every day in any way you see fit. I do hope this has brought you clarity and guidance and has helped you in some way. If it did, drop a comment below to let me know. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. Make sure you have that bell notification set so you can be notified when new content is posted on my channel. If you would like to book with me, all of my services and how you can book with me, along with all the ways you can connect with me outside of YouTube are in the description box below. Have a beautiful rest of your day, night, or afternoon. Love and light.